My name is Adam Urato, and uh, I'll be talking to you today about antidepressants in pregnancy, uh, in particularly the SSRI antidepressants. I'm a maternal fetal medicine specialist at Tufts Medical Center in Boston and Metro West Medical Center in Framingham. It's actually interesting, I was actually born at Metro West Medical Center in Framingham, and shortly, or a few years after uh, I was born there, they converted the labor and delivery unit into offices. So I actually see patients now in the office where I was born in. So um, it's, uh, it's really a remarkable uh, spe and special thing for me. Here uh, I am with my parents in the, uh, in the office 44 years later. Uh, in terms of disclosures, uh, I am an expert witness in litigation uh, regarding antidepressants. The first thing I want to emphasize first and foremost in this area is that depressed pregnant women need good treatment and care. Nothing that I'm about to say should be seen as arguing that we should be ignoring depressed pregnant women. Depressed pregnant women need good treatment and care and we shouldn't ignore depression. Uh, I care for, and I care for these patients every day. Uh, in my practice. Some of them uh, choose to stop their antidepressants, some of them choose to stay on them, and whatever they decide, I support them and I provide good care to them um, either way. But what this talk is about is about warning and the public needing to be aware of what the science is showing about the use of antidepressants in pregnancy. I basically see warning signs of an ongoing catastrophe that's occurring, and uh, I really think the FDA needs to review this. 